Hey guys, what is going on? It's Boykish Cliff here. Hope you guys have a good day. Um, so, today, what, or last night, it was finally the night that everybody's dreams have come true, came true. Um, and they announced Luke Skywalker from the Mandalorian series. Guys, let me just tell you something. I'm going to say it right out of bed. I just pre ordered this figure right now. Um, and, you know, it was, it was a must-have for many of us, um, including me. Um, it's one of those figures where you just cannot pass up. It's, it's, yeah, you just, you just can't, you can't. Uh, you know, I do have it on pre-order. I don't want to show my information, um, but it's, it's here. So, there. Um, but yeah, I did pre-order it. Um, you know, I don't pre-order things often. You know, I did pre-order the Cyborg and the Mysterio and then this. Um, so, I gotta, gotta stay cool with pre-orders nowadays because I don't want to go rogue, you know. Um, but, uh, something like this had to be pre-ordered. Um, you know, the long wait is, is kind of sucks. It's a year and a half. Um, but, you know, it's, 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 it's a good amount of time. Now, do I believe Hot Toys will go with that wait time? Honestly, I, th I say, I say, yeah. I mean, look, right now, currently, they're, 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 they're tracking up right now with, I think they're getting, you know, they're going back to normal right now with Hot Toys, and I think the time is okay. I'm not going to be surprised if it gets delayed till 2023. I won't be surprised at all, and actually that's pretty good for me so I can save up money for this. Um, so, yeah. Um, yeah, I, I had to pre-order it, you know. Um, it's just something I had to get. So you guys know, this is a buy or pass video, and this was definitely a buy for me. Um, but let's just get let's go through the photos, shall we? Okay, so we got Luke Skywalker with the amazing Dark Trooper, uh, crushed Dark Trooper, and oh my God, this is an amazing piece. Um, you know, there's, there's a pose right here. If I can zoom in, if I can, yes, there's a pose right here. If I can show it to you guys, this pose. I'm telling you right now. You know, I, I have you know I, I've seen some of these promo photos for for many figures, and these people are taking shots and posing it. I was never really amazed by it. But this pose really amazed me. Um, I, I just, I was me mesmerized with this pose. pose, um, And I'm gonna copy this pose, definitely. I'm with the little tweaks here and there. Uh, but yeah, this is such a great pose. He's looking in the back while the Dark Trooper's getting crushed. I do wish that we got the full body of the Dark Trooper, um, but that's okay. Um, you know, you can't ask for everything, you know. Um, and now a lot of people are wondering, Will the Dark Trooper sell out? And I say yes, um, as Ari says every time. Um, yes, I do believe that this figure, that Dark Trooper will sell out. Um, you know, it, troopers don't tend to sit, sit for a very long time. Uh, they, they, they tend to sell out pretty soon. Um, so expect that with the Coruscant Guard, the uh, Fire First Troopers, if you guys are, you know, FOMO with that, go get it. Right now, currently, that's not my, my, I do love clone troopers, but I am collecting Marvel, Star Wars, and DC, so I have to cut a few things. Um, so troopers are it's not the way to go. I do have Cody and I do have Rex on order, but those are like the main clone troopers that I really want to get. So that's just me. Um, but you never know. You know, in the future, I might get one or two of them each. I will probably buy maybe two Coruscant guards and two um, Fire Force troopers, maybe three. Who knows if I do have the money for it that in, in, in time. So... Yeah, I mean, the only one big disappointment that I wish it came with, R2. I do wish they came with an R2. I think that would have been such an obvious thing for Hot Toys to do. Um, now, would that mean they will do it later? I do think so. I mean, if they're teasing R2 here, they must have, they, they have to come with another R2. I mean, it's it's been a while now. Uh, I think it needs an, an upgrade. Um, so... It's such a beautiful figure, guys. I just love the black cloak and just this outfit of Return of the Jedi outfit. It's my favorite outfit of Luke. Um, although the pilot Luke was pretty good too, but this one's my favorite. Um, or even Bespin uh, Luke. So, the Bespin outfit. Um, yeah, guys. There's nothing much to say about it. It's just, you guys know my feelings towards Luke. You guys know my feelings towards Star Wars and things like this. This is a must-have. This is the 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 main in my opinion he is the main character of all star wars let's put it that way he is the person that created star wars this this is not created like created in the story but he just he created this whole phenomenon the, the star wars thing you know it, this character luke skywalker such a big character in so many people's lives you know i know aries from six Skull cantina 
He's a huge Luke Skywalker fan. Um, so, you know, it, it, it touches everybody's hearts. And this one did. Um, it touched my heart. You know, as a kid, I always loved Luke Skywalker, although I didn't pay attention to him too much. But he definitely was in, in, my, in my part of life. Uh, part of my life. So I had to get it. I had to get it. This was a different day one period for me. Um, you know, I, I really wanted to go in the past and go buy some of those other Lukes, but then I knew that after the you know the, the, this guy showed up in the Mandalorian, I was like, I'm just gonna wait, I'm gonna wait for this guy. So I did pre-order it. Price is actually surprisingly actually okay. It's not the best price, but it is a good a good price. Um, so for if you guys want to the prices right now, for the regular edition with I mean, I'm not gonna include special edition because that's just free. Uh, 285 doesn't make any difference. So 285 for the regular edition and two, I mean 330 for the deluxe version. Do I think that's a fair price? Yes, I I believe it's a fair price. I mean you're talking about a character at the end, a, 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 such a big character and a pivotal moment of the series, and. Yeah, 330 is the best. It's a DX figure. You're getting crushed, uh, Dark Trooper. Uh, you're getting the figure, the presence of itself. I mean, yeah, it's 330. I think it's a really fair price. It's not a, the best price, but it's a fair price. Um, I was really hoping maybe 300 for the maybe 305, 315 um, for it, uh, but that's okay. I mean, this is a really good price, and it, then it's also slated to quarter uh, quarter four of 2022. Uh, so. Got a year and a half to wait. Um, that's pretty good. Um, but then again, could get delayed. So, yeah, guys. Um, this is a figure that everybody needs in their collection. I feel like every Star Wars fan that, that that doesn't have a Luke Skywalker needs to have this in the collection. I'm sorry, guys. I know I, I don't want to be an enabler or anything, but this is a must-have, like anything else. I mean, in my opinion, I think this is... A must-have than Mandalorian. And maybe I might be pushing it too much, but I think this is this is something you need to have in the collection more than Mandal the Mandalorian. That's just me. Uh, look, you can bash me in the comments if you want. You can dislike if you want. But I think the Luke Skywalker is the character to have in the collection. It is. If you're hey, look, if you only want one figure to represent your Star Wars collection, it'll be this one. Simple as that. It'll be this one. Um, no question about it. No question about it. It's going to be this guy. Um, and I'm not a completionist. You know, I'm not going to buying every single figure of the Mandalorian line. I just can't. You know, I'm collecting Star Wars, Marvel, and DC. It's just not possible. So for me personally, this is a figure that um, I need. Now, when figures that I want are just sort of like, you know, push back. Like, I can, I can you know, just, you know, let that sit there. And maybe I might change my mind later on. Um, but this one is a definite buy. Um, yeah, guys. Um, you guys would be crazy if you guys don't get this. This is a must-have for everybody's collection who's a Star Wars fan. Um, and if you only need one figure... To, if, you're, if you're getting into Star Wars collection, this is a good figure to start off with, guys. Come on. It's a great figure to start with. And a lot of people are going to be happy now. And I'm happy, too. So... Accessory wise, let's talk about the accessories. Now, it does come with a back background, cardboard background. I personally, this might I might just be in the minority here. I do think the backdrop has some um, uh, use, in my opinion. I think it does look good. Um, now the other backboards that I've seen, you know, the armor, you know, some other figures, not really, you know. But this one I, I do see having an importance, and like I might use it. Uh, just because it, it's a pretty good one. So I, I'm going to use it. Uh, you do get ten, five pairs of hands um, for Luke. And a new thing now with Grogu. I know there's a lot of Grogu. There's Grogu Mania everywhere with Hot Toys. You are getting two pairs of hands, interchangeable hands for Grogu. Which was a surprising thing for me. And it's articulated. Finally Hot Toys is articulating these Grogu's. Um, next thing they should really do some, not, rather than sculpted clothes, they should do it, you know, fabric material. So Hot Toys, do that. Um, and you do get a lightsaber, you do get a swishing lightsaber, and you do get the crushed armor, um, dark trooper, and a special edition bonus of, if you're going for the special, special edition bonus, you do get a hologram of Moff Gideon's ship, um, and a base, obviously, and an interchangeable, and, you know, movable eyes. 330 is a good price. Now, the only difference between it, between this and the regular version is pretty evident. It, the only difference, that, the only thing you don't get with the regular version is the crushed dark, dark trooper, so... There you go. Now, 
As far as Dark Trooper goes, I do believe, I do believe that Dark Trooper will sell out. Now, I think I mentioned this you know, earlier in the video. I do believe the Dark Trooper will sell out. I will be probably getting one Dark Trooper now because, you know, I don't do action sort of scene dynamic, you know, scenes with my figures. You know, they're pretty much museum poses. But for this one, it has to be an, an action pose. I feel that, you know, you could put them in like a normal pose, you know, that, that's so cool to you. But I, the way how I envision it, I want Luke Skywalker to do that crushing scene. You know, he's crushing the Dark Trooper that he gets with the, the deluxe version and having an, another Dark Trooper approaching to him and about to shoot him. And he's, def you know, he's deflecting with the light lightsaber. So that would be a cool scene to have. I might just get one Dark Trooper, maybe two might be pushing it, but one right now. I'm not going to pre-order yet because I need to save up money for that one. But Dark Trooper is definitely going to be on the list of pre-orders. So there you have it, guys. And is it now? Is a buyer pass. Now you guys know it's a 120% of pass. That's going over the percentage bar. This is a this is a buy. This is an instant day one pre-order for me, guys. I'm I'm excited. Last time when I saw this picture, I was like, <gasps> you know, I was excited. I, like I knew it was coming, but like I didn't know it was coming like so fast, and it did. And not fast, but it good. You know, it came out pretty good. Um, so yeah, guys, I pre-ordered this figure from Sideshow. Um, and uh, you guys, you know, go for it. Go pre-order this figure. It's 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 a must buy for everybody's collection. It's a must have. So there you go, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments down below. Do you guys agree with my opinions? Then share your guys' opinions towards these figures. Do you guys agree with me or disagree with me in some sort of areas? Let me know in the comments down below and like or dislike the video if you guys want to. That, that that's that's your personal preference. And if you guys want to subscribe to the channel, you guys always can. Just press, press that button there. And if you guys want to follow me on Instagram, it's kg underscore collector. There you go, guys. Hope you guys have a good day, and I'll see you guys next one. Bye-bye.